Okay, here's a sketch of the situation. We're starting at buoy A, went 3,700 miles to the left or west, 1,700 miles somewhere in the north direction, not directly north, and then back to where we started for 3,000 meters. Uh, and I assume you use the law of cosines to find the measure of angle C, which is about 100 degrees. And then once you have angle C, you can use the law of sines to find angle B, which is 52.95. And that allows us to find the bearing of C from B, north, uh, 37.1 degrees east, because that's B sub 1 right there. And now, if we kind of draw these two horizontal and vertical segments at point C, we can see that this angle uh, B sub 1 right here with a measure of 37.1 is congruent to this angle right here because we've got two parallel lines, uh, these two vertical lines cut by this transversal uh, so alternate interior angles are coming along. And if that's 37.1 and all of angle C is 100, 100 take away the 37.1 leaves 63.1 degrees. That's B sub 2. And we can say that the bearing from C to A is south. 63.1 degrees east. Okay, we could also say that it's north this many degrees east. Uh, if we wanted to start at north. So there you go. Hope that helped. If you have any questions, post a comment.